that we did on our own. We know that some families are grieving right now because they have to lay their loved ones to rest. But we know that you saw us through the night and brought us here another day, Lord. So we want to say thank you, Lord. We thank you for the pastor of this house. We thank you for the shepherd of Yabs, Ricky, because we know that he has been so much to us. He has given up so much to us, so we say thank you, Lord. We ask that you come into this service and bless everyone from the pulpit to the door, Lord. We ask that you touch down on the speaker today, Lord, and just reign through your glory, Lord. Speak through them and touch your people. We know that someone is in need of deliverance. We know someone needs healing, Lord. We know someone is struggling with financial problems, but we know for you to be a provider, a doctor, a judge, a lawyer. So we say thank you right now in the name of Jesus. We ask that you bless our children that will be returning to school because we know that we have a lot of Trayvons walking around here. And we know that you are the ultimate protector. So we ask that you reign over them as they get on those school buses, as they walk through those schools, as they go through football practices, Lord. We ask that the same way that we came here, Lord, that you take us away. And we'll never forget to give you all the glory, honor, and praise. And it's in Jesus' name I pray, amen. amen. 